was just trying to beat the traffic Tuesday morning when he found himself in what looked like a scene out of an action movie. Oh, you think you're going to get away. As the sun came up, Marshall Thompson witnessed a scene suited for a Hollywood movie set. He just cut right into traffic and he lost control. I started spinning and he spun right into the semi truck trailer. Tuesday, Thompson crossed paths with a car trying to get away from police. I think it was all. It was kind of scary. It all, all happened really quickly. Thompson watched the car speed toward him in his rearview mirror, but he didn't have much time to react. I saw the car start spinning and I was like, I got to do something. I got to stop. He managed to stop and offered to lend a hand to police. Do you need any assistance? No, keep your car. Okay. Come here. And they pulled their guns and I was like, okay, this is a little more serious. Four people in the car were taken into custody. Miraculously, no one was seriously hurt. Four people actually walked away from that car uh, and the truck driver was able to hold the truck together and not cause any other accidents. He's thankful police peacefully resolved the situation. The officers were calm and, and handled it in a, a very professional way. Despite the unexpected delay, Thompson made it to work on time. I usually start, start off early, mainly to beat the traffic. He's been commuting from Layton to Salt Lake City for more than a decade. So this is the first instance that I've seen something that dramatic. And he won't soon forget this one commute that was anything but ordinary. I've reviewed the, the video a few, a few times and thought, well, wow, that kind of looks like something I watched on TV. And Thompson tells us those dash cams can be valuable for insurance purposes if you ever get in an accident. He's had his about two years, but this is the first time that he's ever had to keep the video. Live in the studio, John Franke, Fox 13 News, Utah.